Good afternoon, everybody. I ran into a Facebook post today that just left me in awe of God again, <laughs> which is something that he continues to do with all of us. He's just so fascinating and getting so much more easy to understand and partner with as we open up <clears throat> this fallen realm to let the king of glory come in just want to thank you lord for this time thank you for the wisdom and revelation that is just sweeping across this nation across the globe about how good you are god and I would just ask, Lord, that you would send extra comfort to those who are hurting, extra wisdom for those who are trying to get things figured out, and extra love for those who have been rejected, in Jesus' name. Okay, so I was on Facebook today, and I ran across a post. I read the post, and I thought, wow is that really true and so i googled it and i found several articles on it and come to find out what i'm about to share with you really is true and they say whatever is true in the spirit is true in the natural and this couldn't be more fitting and more relevant for such a time as this but the post it, it told a little story but i'm just going to get to the meat of it I'm not sure how many people under, realize that lamb's blood is used as an antidote for snake venom. <laughs> okay, I'll say it again. Lamb's blood is used as an antidote for snake bite. Now, I didn't even bother pulling up scriptures that could be relevant to the blood of the lamb and then serpents and how the blood of the lamb beat the serpent. But I just wanted to share that and let Holy Spirit and you have a heyday with that. We hear all the prophecies and the prophets speaking and the deliverance ministers that are rising up everywhere to get people delivered from demons, from snakes. You hear about Python, this and that, uh, witchcraft, which is snakes and serpents, but lamb's blood is the antidote to all of it. Father, in the name of Jesus, we just want to thank you for your love. Jesus, we thank you for the blood, the blood that delivers us, heals us, protects us, and purchases us back for the good, to the good, good Father. We just want to thank you for our redemption. We want to thank you for uh, taking us through a process that is painful at times, but it, we, we can't lose because you are the forever victor. The enemy is the forever loser, and we just love, honor, and cherish you, Lord. We adore you. In Jesus' name, amen.